Hello friends, I am Kushagar Sharma and you are watching my YouTube channel All Tech Yan. And uh, today we will continue our uh, Paint Out tutorial series. And uh, we will see how to install the uh, Paint Out server. And in the previous video, we have seen how to install the Paint Out client tool. And uh, today we will continue with the Paint Out server. And uh, in the previous video, I have, sh I have shared the link to download this file i will share it once again uh, you have to just go on the download page and you have to download this third file which is pentao server c 8.0.0.0 slash 28 dot zip so it is of approximate 1.2 gb so just download this file and extract this file after extracting you will see a folder name with pentao uh, with the same name, I have, uh, I have currently modified the name, but uh, you will see the same name which is here Pentao server hyphen C hyphen 8.0000.28. So you will see a folder with that name, and after that, what you have to do, you have to just uh, go inside the this folder now uh, there are some things we need to do before starting the uh, pentaho server so first of all we need to set the uh, pentaho home variable name inside our environment variable so uh, for that you need to know what is the name of the variable so for that uh, yeah you have to uh, open this start.pentao bit file into the notepad just remember you should not uh, modify anything in this file it is very important file so just uh, open it uh, in the read only mode and do not modify anything in this file and actually uh, you sh should not uh, edit the, you should not even open this file because uh, the in the 99 percent cases the name of the variable remains same pentaho java home so please skip this name uh, for every time you have to just set this name in the environment uh, variable so just select this variable copy this variable and close this file and go into your uh, advanced advanced setting in the uh, you can go here by just click right click on the my computer just go in the properties just go in the advanced system setting now click on the environment variable now you have to define one system variable here new uh, i already defined it as you can i, I can show you i can show you yeah as you can see i i have to just click on new just uh, give your variable name just copy paste your name here and in the vari variable value you have to give give path of your jdk as you can see in my uh, window i have given the path of jdk so you need to have jdk installed in your system as i mentioned in the previous video so just give the path and click ok so uh, this is done just you need to click ok ok so now you are good to go so now the basic setup has been done now one thing please remember which uh, sometime you f might face the issue uh, the uh, server require a port number so by default port number for bi and the uh, pentaho is 8080 but it is quite possible that 8080 might uh, might be used by some other application so in that case you might face some issue so in that case what should you do you should go in the tomcat directory inside the pentaho server and that instead go the config folder 
now you as you can see there is a file server.xml so just right click on that so when you go there then uh, you can you will see the here I have already changed the port number but here 8080 should be there so if you want to change it then you can change the port number and then close the file uh, please remember do not modify anything else here because it will impact your functionality and it is not not at all necessary to change the port number but in some cases you might face some issue because 80 is a very common port which is used by HTTP service so in that case you can change the port number here just uh, go open the file control do control f search for 8080 and replace the port uh, it with the desired, desired port number nothing else you should be do, doing here just close this file now you are ready to go now just to go backward go in the parent go into the parent directory here you can see there is a start pantaho.bat since we are using windows so we will use bat file otherwise if we are using linux then you have to uh, run the sh file shell file so since we are using uh, window i will use bat file just hit enter as you can see process has been started so if you are using first time then it will it may take up to 7 to 10 minutes uh, let's see what happens uh, so it is uh, getting ready it is starting the server it is setting some variable so just be with me the process is still running just be patient uh, it may take some time it also depends on the uh, your laptop or your pc configuration but normally it takes uh, 5 to 10 minutes I think now it is installed the process is completed just let me check if I can access the server now so, so this is your URL your IP address since I am using same laptop so this is my localhost your port number which we have mentioned in the server.xml then write pentao and uh, after Penta or hit enter so I think yeah 
so as you can see the sa setup is done you are able to access the Pentaho server now so when you click in the login as the elevate evaluator so password is mentioned there so just use that demo user and password you can later create your own users and you can use them for your use for just now go with this dummy users as you can see the dashboard has been loaded so we today we have done the installation of the pentaho server so i am using internet explorer here so if you if you are using some other browser and if you have if you face some browser related issue then please do let me know in the comment section i will try to solve the issue because uh, in the past i i also